Good evening, my dear subjects. And welcome to Minecraft! Wow! Holy shit! This game is so requested by all you guys, but th there's a thing, there's a, there's a reason why I don't like recording Minecraft, and it's because it lags a little bit, and because I don't find it all that interesting of a game to play and record. I don't know why it's so requested. I mean, I couldn't imagine, like, watching someone play this game over and over and over again. I think that'd get kind of boring. But anyway, that's why I only really play custom maps, because those are always different, and it's it's something it has a goal in it to achieve for, so... That's the reason why I only play really custom maps. I'll, I might go on servers every now and then, but... Eh, it's, it, it's not very often. I really don't play Minecraft that much. But, uh... Here, we're going to be playing this map that I found on the Minecraft forums. I usually skim through there, check if there's any good maps I, that I kind of want to play. And this one looked pretty good. I mean, it didn't look amazing, but it, it's better than all the other shit I see on there. But <laughs> let's just, uh, if you want to play a good custom map, play this one. Download it from uh, the Minecraft forums. It's probably the best map you'll ever find on the fucking internet for Minecraft. No joke. Anyway, not because it was made by me, but... <laughs> Alright, let's just play Detective Dan. Let's get right into it. It's, uh... I forget what the subtitle they named it for. But, yeah. Like, Detective Dan and the something of the something something something. Whoa. Was. Alright, so... Let me, uh... Turn some volumes down. Where do I do that? Uh, here, Master Volume like it fairly low. Uh, sure. Whatever, all the way up. Music, he said to uh, probably keep off. I don't even know. Alright, so these are the map makers. We got some, uh, a slime-faced guy and Luigi. I don't know. Alright. Not multiplayer. This is a single player. Plus, I know this is a short map. Cool. All sounds 100% except music. Don't change difficulty. Don't change game mode. Don't cheat players. Don't take my head. Unlucky. Who's unlucky? I don't see your head. I see those two. Don't take my head. Unlucky. Oh. Wow, look at that. Oh. What the fuck is this shit? Whatever. Anyway, continuing. Give us some love on this map. And if you are playing Dante DM, hi. Said by that slime guy. Cool. Story. You are Dan West, a great detective that is only stumped by his wife's murder. You have been working at the agency in Woodcliffe for a while now, and everything has been quiet until you turn on the radio to hear something shocking. By the way, this takes place in the 1980s. The date is uh, probably June 3rd. For the dumb people, June 3rd. Well, good thing I'm not dumb. Follow up the objectives and hints. Do not, uh, pull me cool. What? Do not pull me cool. I don't understand Minecraft logic, so I don't know what that means. P.S. Step on gold blocks to talk to people. Don't get off one and back on, or else it will keep spamming a chat. I don't plan on it. Okay, so Detective Dan, what does this sign say? And the murder on Saffron Lane. Yep, that's what, that's the subtitle. Start game. Did you read everything? It's important. I think I did. Unlucky Bacon. And JL Sticky. That sounds really weird. <laughs> Presents Detective Dan and the murder on Saffron Lane. <laughs> BREAKING NEWS! For the first time in five years at 10.30 last night, a murder has occurred on Saffron Lane. We have been told the killer has gotten away. The victim, 23-year-old Stacy Birch, died from a gunshot to the head. Ring, 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 ring. Unbelievable. Anyway, should probably get the phone. It is probably the agency. No objective. Get it to the phone downstairs. What the hell is this on me? Oh, I was inside the radio. What was I doing on that? Probably making love to it. I don't even know. 
Wow, this looks pretty cool. They added TVs to Minecraft. <laughs> oh yeah, this had a texture pack. That's probably what it is, texture pack. Not many other textures are changed. You know, I saw this in the other game. I wonder if, like, they actually added some of this stuff to Minecraft. I don't even know. How worthless of a room. Picks up a... Hello, this is Dan West. Dan, we need you at the crime scene right now. I'll be right there. New objective. Go to your garage through the door under the stairs and go to the crime scene. This is a toaster? Uh, uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> Alright, I'm leaving. What the fuck? Oh, that's some weird shit. Presma! Hold on, hold on, don't get too ahead of yourself. That's my license plate. Trip girls! I, I find it weird how Minecraft has an auto jump right now. It's, it's like, it's pretty annoying actually. Alright, so I guess I gotta press this tire. Kill. Cool. Whoa. Man, I know I've been in this in a, in a while, but this looks sketchy. Oh well, time to go to the crime scene. Cool. What the hell? What the hell? Did I like back into this? Cool. I approve. <laughs> Alright, closed for health issues. Oh, that's pretty cool. Tommy Rizzo. Cool, let's step on his gold block. Okay, gold block. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh my god, I just took his head off. Alright, I don't know. I swear you were supposed to step on the gold blocks, but. Maybe, I don't know. Open 24 hours, Robbie's guns. I am, uh. Should I go there? Actually, this place isn't really that big. Might as well. Let's go. Robbie Boulder is his name. So, you know what? I need to turn off that auto jump. It's actually super fucking annoying. How do we do that? I forget. Uh. Damn it. Is that it? Is that it? No. Controls? Auto jump. Off. Yay. Oh, wow. Uh, I can just make him go naked. Okay, maybe nothing's working. Hello, sir? Sir? Oh, there's a pressure plate right here. Oh no, maybe that- oh no, that ain't fresh plate. Fuck. What the hell do I do? Okay, I guess not in here. I swear that that sign said to step on those gold bl golden things, but they're not working. Lights Club! Closed for reasons! That's a good reason. Woodcliff Detective Agency. Hello? Can't even get in my own place. Julia's Juice. That sounds really disturbing. Johnny's Apartments. Hey, Johnny. What's up? What the fuck do I do? Whatever. Okay. You take a look at the water through the glass. It looks tasty. Go. Elevators are broken. Yep, they're broken. Oh, it turns. Cool. Wall... Wall fart groceries. Oh. A Alden McFart. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. There's like no groceries in here, man. You need to restock. Dead end! Police line, do not cross. I'm crossing. Would you like to talk to Officer Paul Millsack? Oh, I forget how to do this. Shit, T. Yes. Hello, Dan. The crime scene is upstairs. I would go check it out. She got shot in the head and the bullet is still sticking out. You should try to take it out for research. Ew. Alright, I'll check it out. Okay, I will meet you upstairs. No objective. Go upstairs and check out the crime scene. Okay, I guess it was working. It was just like... I wasn't at that point in time yet. So, uh, an empty cup. I guess that's part of the, uh, evidence that I'm gonna be needing soon. Right, I'm done.
Wow, this is perfect. I'll test the DNA at the police station after I talk to everyone. Oh, sweet, I'm already ahead of myself. Fuck yeah. Hey, it's you again. Would I like to talk? Yeah! Here she, here she is. I bet she was pretty... She was pretty... <laughs> I bet she was pretty before all the, uh... Well, you know. Yeah, so what exactly happened here that night? Well, it looks like the killer was hiding in the corner, waiting for Stacy to get out of her room, and then bang! The bullet got stuck in her head, and no one wants to take it out. Luckily, the kid wasn't here. He was sleeping over at a friend's house in down, downtown Woodcliffe. Man, that's crazy. Still can't believe there's been a murder. Anyway, any suspects? Yeah. Here's a book. A cool guy made it for me. With all... <laughs> Alright, I, I need to chill out. Yeah, here's a book a cool guy made for me with all the suspect names in it and more. You can talk to these people after you check out this house and see what clues you can find. Just do your thing. You're a good detective. Okay, thanks, Paul. No problem. I will be up here if you need anything. Tips. Do not talk to Tommy last. New objective. Look around the house for clues and take the bullet out of Stacy's head. Kill Mr. and Miss... Michael Birch. Hey! <sighs> ain't even in her head, is it? It's in the wall. Why take it out? I got the bullet. Sweat. Oh, yeah. She died. She's very dead. Uh, Mark Birch's room. What's in here, huh? Whoa, look at that. Endless green. Wow. There's also some, uh, some stuff on top of that building for some reason. Alright, so I found some evidence. So I say I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing pretty good. Do not talk to Tommy last. I don't know. I don't remember Tommy. I'm gonna go talk to him first. We you Tommy? You're Tommy. Who said that? What's up, Tommy? Yes. What do you want? Okay. Wow, someone woke up on the wrong side of the bed. Sorry. It's just my restaurant got shut down. Fucking bitches. Okay then, may I ask you some questions? Yeah, <sighs> alright. Oh, sorry, I forgot to introduce myself. I'm Dan West. I'm a detective on the case of Stacy Birch. Okay, that makes more sense now. Where were you last night at 10.30? I was signing some stupid fucking papers for my restaurant, because it was closing down. Fucking motherfuckers. Text Master 1000. If it stops right there, just go to another suspect. This just may be a corrupt chunk. Not really, but I knew Michael a bit. Not really, but I knew Michael a bit. Okay, tell me about Stacy. Well, she was quiet. She stayed at home, and she just got laid off her job. Thanks for the help. See you around. Wow, you don't even say bye, motherfucker. I'm gonna cut your dick off. Let's go talk to this uh, noob over here. But I like to talk! Uh, yeah! What's that? What can I do for ya? Hi, I'm Dan West. I'm a detective on the Stacey Birch case. Can I ask you some questions? Alright, sure. Where were you last night at 10.30? I was running my gun shop like always. 24 hours, baby. Okay, are you close to the Birch family? Not really, but that poor kid Mark must be devastated. Alright then, I'd like to know what gun this bullet came out of. That right there's a deagle bullet. Alright then, I'd like to know the purchase of that gun in the last week. Let me take a look here. Um, the last couple of purchases on the Deagle was Alden, Johnny, and Mikhail. Alright, thanks for the help. I'll be on my way. Thanks. Weird. I thought Michael was out of town. Cool. I'm getting somewhere. Mikhail was supposed to be out of town. But I guess he's not. Those for reasons. Alright, let's go back to Johnny's apartments. 
Hello and welcome to Johnny's Apartments. The elevator is down, but the apartments are up. I don't need any apartment. I'm Dan West, detective on the case of Stacy Birch. I need to ask some questions. All right, hit me. <sighs> Where were you last night? Ten thirty. Not creepy at all, but I was in my apartment working. Are you close to the Birch family at all? Well, I live right down the street from them. Other than that, no. Guess that's the end of that chapter. Go. Let's go check out this guy in here. This weird looking face fish person. Yeah, shit reeks in here. Ha ah, dear. I'm Alden, owner of Walford Groceries. How can I help you? Ha, I'm Dan West, detective on the State Spurge case. I was wondering if I could ask you some uh, Um I just said ha ah, dear I uh, don't This guy is nuts. You slowly back away until you reach the door. Alright, thanks. Glad I got out of there. Alright, so I guess that guy was looping. That's pretty cool. Guess this is the last room. Prisoner Luke. Impression straight up sucks. I asked to go to the bathroom and they're like, oh, we don't have one. And I'm like, oh, what the frick? Sounds painful. Like you wouldn't believe. Man, I shouldn't have said I was a Nazi. Well, that was a pointless conversation. Alright, yeah, that's a DNA scanner. Place DNA here. Beep boop, beep boop. Calculating. Scanning complete. DNA's Johnny Newings. What? Johnny? He seems so nice. This doesn't seem right. I should go back and talk to him again. No objective. Go talk to Johnny again. Let's go do that. Johnny. Right. No, you're Tommy. You're not Johnny. Where's Johnny? Johnny in here? Johnny's apartments. I found a cup with your DNA on it at the crime scene. Care to explain? I've been framed. I swear I didn't do it. I never been in anyone's house before. I think I believe him, but there's no way he did this. It just doesn't make sense. Pick an option. Believe him. Lock him up. God damn it, I hate games do this shit. I'm in frame, I swear I didn't do it. I have never been in their house before. He had to have been, if he had touched that pot. Lock that shitter up. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, really? Redownload the map to try again. Oh, that's bullshit. Ah, <laughs> F-bomb. Looks like I'm gonna have to.